Hi, I'm Shelley LeBeau with Child Care Land and Common. Today I want to share with you frog math. This is a great addition to any math center or free play time activity. You can find these patterns on my website at childcareland.com underneath the video section and it comes with the frog, the flies, and the number circles. I've also made blank circles if you wanted to write maybe some addition or subtraction equations in those circles and use it for that as well. You can set this up as, uh, uh, any way that you want. I print them on cardstock, laminate them, and on the back of each piece I have a self-adhesive magnet that we use because I like to use it on a metal cookie sheet, but you don't have to. You can set it up the way, any way you wish. And what you would do is you would have the frog sitting out, the number circle sitting out, and the flies off to the side in a pile, and the child or the teacher, depending on the age, would select a number, and then the child would put the correct amount of flies that matches the number that's on the frog body. So that was six, and then we needed to put six in. Another way to do it is to put a certain number of fr flies on the cookie sheet or if you have it set up, and then the child would need to find the, the correct number of how many that was and put it on. So you can reverse it if you want. Instead of putting the number on first, find, and then do the flies, you can do the flies first and then find the number. So besides number circles, as I said, I've had, I have um, blank circles that you can write simple math equations on. So this we have 3 plus 3, so the child would put 3 flies down, oops, getting carried away, 3 flies and 3 more flies, and they would count the number of flies, and that would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, so the answer to 3 plus 3 is 6. You could also make a subtraction equation. And could do maybe five minus one. So you would start with five flies out. And then you would take away one fly, and that would leave you with one, two, three, four. So again, this is really a lot of fun. fun. The children really enjoy um, the frog and the fly matching. You can have it set up in any center. You, can, you don't have to have it on a magnet sheet. You can just have it on a table. You could do it on a felt board. There's lots of ways you can do it, but I find that for me the magnetic board is, um, is a lot of fun for the children. So for Frog Math, I'm Shelley Levette with ChildCareLand.com, and thanks for watching.